Good morning, right near the intersection of 19 and 228, and we are seeing major gusting winds. I want to give you an idea of just of the snow drifts we've been seeing since we arrived here. This is up against the curb in this parking lot. The snow has been accumulating just as we've been sitting here, especially over the past half an hour. We have spotted a couple cars driving by through this intersection. Freedom Road is right down there to my right behind me. Picking up, and we also have noticed the drop in temperatures. When we arrived here, I'd say it was mid 30s. It's now dropped down to the low 20s, and it is cold up here in Cranberry. To give you an idea, we left the KDKA newsroom downtown around 3:30. Within about 10 or so minutes, that pouring rain that we were getting around 3:30 turned into sleet, freezing rain. We noticed those balls of ice on our windshield, and then we approached up towards Camp Horn Road around quarter after or quarter to four. And that's when the snow officially began. And ever since we've been heading up from Camp Horn Road up here to South Butler, it has been snowing. And the snow here in this parking lot has been accumulating. Back out here live, though, I do want to just give you one more idea of just the gusting winds. Those traffic signals and the red lights there in the distance at the intersection of 19 have been blowing in the wind, significantly picking up just over the past couple minutes. And we did spot finally our first one or two PennDOT trucks rolling through the area. but. 10 or so minutes ago, but up until then we hadn't seen any plows out here. So it does look like they are getting out here and beginning to plow and treat the roads. But right now those roads are still snow covered. We'll be bringing you live reports all morning long from here in Cranberry Road for now. We'll send it back to you guys in the studio.